What's going on guys, my name's Liam, and today I've got something a bit new for you, it's not Minecraft. Instead, this is a cube world tutorial. Um, so yeah, today I'm going to teach you guys how to craft a health potion, the vital to stay alive in this dangerous world because everything wants to kill you. So yeah, let's get straight into this. The first thing you want to do is find something called a heart flower. Very easy to pick out, they're, uh, they're just around the terrain, all naturally generated. And they look like little hearts, that's where they get the name from. So you're going to want to pick a few of these up by picking E when you're looking at them. And yeah, let's move on to the next step. After you've got your heart flower, the next thing you want to do is find a town, such as I have here. The easiest way to find towns is just to follow the brown, worn-out path. and They will all lead to towns. Towns can be very rare, it did take me about 10 minutes to look around my world to find towns. But uh, once you get into town, it's very easy to complete the rest of the steps. Towns will have a trading district, a adventure district, a crafting district, and a pet district, and you will need to locate the trading district. Once you have located the trading district, you want to find a shop, which has a sign on it that looks like a money bag, and you want to go inside and talk to the merchant in there. You can see straight away she's selling flasks. You need these to create the health potions. Hover over the flask icon and right click in order to buy some. The flasks do cost money, and if you don't have any, you can hover over your own items. You can see your inventory is displayed on the left. Hover over any item you want to not really need. Uh, you can right-click and sell in order to raise the funds to buy a flask. Okay, after you have purchased your flask, you need to find a stream of water, because we are about to fill our flask. Your stream waters are easy to look at the minimap, they're just a stream of blue. Jump in the stream, and straight away, you can open your crafting menu pressing C. Continuously just click the crafting icon for water flask. You need to be standing in water, but it's very simple to do, shouldn't go wrong. And the final step is to go back into your crafting menu pressing the C button and craft a health potion. All you have to do is same with the same as the water flask, you click on the health potion option and then click as many times as you want on the crafting icon. As many um, items you have, as many water flasks and as many heart flowers you have is how many health potions you can cast. You can craft rather and it will automatically go into your hotkey spot, which is Q. So if you're having a tough battle and you just need to get some health back, just press Q. And if you have health potions on you, you will drink those bad boys away and hopefully defeat the ogre or troll or whatever you're battling. Okay guys, that's going to be it for this tutorial. Let me know if you enjoyed it by clicking the like button. If you want to see more, uh, let me know in the comments below. And I was actually wondering if you guys would want to see a cube let's play, you know, not just a tutorial. Um, I might be doing a couple more tutorials anyway. Just because I found this game so hard to start out with and, you know, I had to have friends to help me, so maybe these videos can help you. But yeah, if you want to see a QO Let's Play, um, yeah, leave it in the comments. Okay guys, that's it from me and my frog mage friend. Uh, level 2 now, I'll have you know. <laughs> but yeah, that's it from me. Let me know in the comments and through likes if you want to see a QO Let's Play and more tutorials. Hopefully this helps you, and if it did, that's great. And uh, my name's Liam, and I will see you next time, whether we play Minecraft, Q World, Call of Duty. We won't play Call of Duty, don't worry. <laughs> but yeah, hope, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.